All right, so we're here with what is definitely a deck. It does exist. It, yes. is, it exists. Uh, we would like to play first with our awesome deck that exists. Two Mesmeric Fiends and two lands, and actually all we really need is like four, so. Yeah. I'm going to keep it. Yeah, sure. Is our opponent going to mulligan to six? Let's exchange a pleasantry. All right. There's a pleasantry. Hi, Tabby. He just and I these. think we're going to open with a salt flats because we don't have any one drops. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, this deck exists, and it is legal in this format. <laughs> and uh, 40 islands may have been better just to make the yeah. opponent <laughs> hesitate on doing anything. Just to tilt them a little bit. Like, whoa, what? It's like he's got all islands and he's not doing anything. <laughs> He's saving it. <laughs> okay, so let's... Uh, swamp? Or should we just get our beats on? Yeah, I'm going to play Swamp, yeah. but... Should we get our beats, beats on, or should we see what, what he's up let's to? Let's see what he's up to. Okay. Let's make sure to do this right now. Okay. Oh, I just thought of something. We could, like, kill our own dude in response to the ability, and then it's gone forever. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He hasn't he hasn't returned my pleasantry, by the way. Okay, what what do we have going on here? We've got sudden strength, elvish aberrate. Wow, this is an expensive deck. I think we take the wild mongrel just so keep flame tongue kavu is very good, but who cares about that? Really? We can get wild mongrel, and the next one can just get the flame yeah, tongue. Yeah, true. Turn four. That is true. Like next turn we play our bear. Yeah, and then we play mm -hmm. that and keep him off the flame tongue from getting the mongrel back. That's a great idea. Unless he do, he might do some shenanigans. He might draw like a a chain lightning. Maybe, yeah. I did see one. So. Oh yeah, there was a chain lightning in here. Yeah. I was thinking more like how he could get faster mana, but I guess he's just gonna opt for nothing. So um, yeah, I'm thinking of getting in for one yeah. first, first and foremost. Let's see what happens. Did. Smack for one. Take one, young man. I don't know if he's actually a young man. He might be old. And then we're gonna it's it's bear time, I think. Yeah. It's bear, bear time. time. So let's uh let's do it this way. Just because this way he might be like, Oh he might have, have a white or a black something or other. Yeah. Yeah. Hi. Oh he exchanged pleasantries. Nice. Woo! Thank you, friend. Uh yeah. Pass the turn. So our Two drop aggro deck <laughs> that has a tendrils of agony <laughs> plan. It's going swimmingly. It's going pretty good so far. Yeah. I mean, we could just get wrecked by all the things. Probably will, but you know. But honestly, this set does not like for something vintage masters, like it really does doesn't seem too swingy. No. Like maybe you get like a Jace or you get like a Black Lotus and you just win the game on turn one or whatever. But like it really doesn't seem like there's too many things to be overly worried about. Everything's just dudes. Uh, one damage to... Okay, sure. Wow. I am fine with this. <laughs> because he's going to like send this in. Oh, it becomes the color of his choice. <laughs> so Exile doesn't won't even work at it against him. Yeah. That's funny. <laughs> oh, well. Um, I think we still fiend the Kavu away. Yeah. Oh, he's not going to play it. Interesting. Oh, maybe, yeah, in a second main. Never mind. For some reason, I looked at this and thought he went to his end step. Yeah, that's fine. All yeah, right. Nothing on your end step. I will always yield to this. Ah! Ah! Ooh! Dark ritual! Now we need... Now we need to do is draw tendrils. <laughs> oh, this is so bad. Uh, I'm going to get in for two, first and foremost. Throw some beats. Doop. Exchange fisticuffs with a gentleman who will take two fisticuffs to the head. And then we're going to do a fiend. And we're going to leave up Dark Ritual Exile, I think. Yeah, that's excitement. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're not, because you can just discard. Huh? You, no, we're not, you can just discard. <laughs> No, but he might like go all we in. Can put or the something. one that dies um, when we get back the top creatures. That's so. true. Um, 
What should we take? Um, well, he doesn't have a land. I still think Kavu is probably the best of all these things. Yeah. We could take the like plus three plus three guy, but I think Kavu is still the one. Because Kavu, if he draws a land, he'll just kill this anyway and get this thing back. So. Exactly. So. Yeah. All right. I have a feeling I this wish game that he would have discarded the Kavu in response or something. He discard his entire hand in response. I, <laughs> I thought, I thought yeah. we could target it. And yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just like, oh, yeah. just discard it so it's not under there. Like, this is oh, going to be wait. so sweet when we Dark Ritual Exile. Oh. Except we're not because then he's just going to make it white. No, he might go all in. He might discard five things. Like but we say no blocks. Every color. Huh? But then he just make it every color. He well, think. maybe he won't. Maybe maybe that's not something he'll do. Maybe he'll make it like uber green. Like I'm going to make this the greenest man alive. Honestly, if he wants to discard his hand, I don't care. Yeah, it's what you want. Yeah. Like, it's just a little bit of beats and we're at 19. What's the worst know. that could happen? Yeah, he just took two anyway. You could take the pump and beats. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something? He discards his entire hand and just make, keeps making him green. Oh, no. He got a thing that makes mana. Yeah. Not usable mana this turn. Ah, oh, shucks. It is usable. Well, it is, but yeah. he has a handful of four and fives. And we will take one. Take a beat. Yow. Oh! Oh, it's a tendrils! <laughs> it's a tendrils! How many spells can we cast? <laughs> uh, okay. Two. So that leaves us with three, four, five, six. So we have six mana, assuming dark ritual. Yeah. We need yeah. two drop. We need, we need another. We need a two drop or we need another land to... Oh, we can't even cast exile. What am I thinking? Uh, whatever. We can I'm, go to I'm a, getting in for two. I don't wait. Tendrils is a uh, tendrils is a sorcery, so yeah, we can't is. we can't attack no no, no, no our no. own creature no. Unfor well, we can and then do it on our second main phase. Oh yes, right there. Yeah. So okay, so I'm just gonna throw out this man because it will get back fiend if he kills us yeah. at least. So That's there's true. that. All right, and we know he doesn't have anything till this turn. It's in the right till right now. Is there any more pleasantries being exchanged in the in the corner? I have a feeling this is going to be an extremely grindy game of just yeah. like little dudes that kind of sometimes do something. Doopy things fighting against doopy things. Yeah, yeah. I and mean, this is pretty... He looks like he was flattened. Like somebody took a rolling pin and just went over his head a little yeah. bit. Just blup, blup, blup. So probably not blocking. Again, if he wants yeah. to discard his hand, fine with me. Uh, did we notice... By any chance, what those what his other four drop was? I don't remember. It was it had goblins in its name. I think it had goblins in its name. I probably should have taken a colorless. screenshot or something, but you know, <laughs> that's a little too professional for for the likes of us. It's a little too uh, yeah too too involved. Good. Yeah, yeah. That requires like mm -hmm. strategy, and so we deck can doesn't need strategy to win. No, no, it just needs luck. That's all <laughs> it needs. So if we get a bear, do we tendrils for three? <laughs> The swamp. Oh, uh, no. Uh, do we exile our own creature? No. <laughs> to tendrils for three? No. No? Okay. Um, I just think we just throw beats at him. Yeah. I like throwing beats at him. Um, other how courts. close are we to dead to this? Not really that close, right? No. He has that pump spell. Yeah, plus but, three, plus three, but nah. I mean, what's he going to... Nah. Actually, he probably should have done that to draw a card just in case he drew a land. Like, I would just use that, get in a little extra yeah. damage when like I didn't need block. need, like, another three damage. And oh, did he draw a, a boom? Did he? Did he, he draw? Something. He drew something. I mean, is he going to pump it now? Uh, Salt Blast. Three damage target creature or player when you cycle it. Okay, so just kill this. That's it. Oh, but does he? Uh, Yeah, no, it just goes to his hand. Oh, he can cycle it because of the double red. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, fine with me. Whatever. Yeah, whatevs. So he gets his Kavu back. Hmm. What's Kavu going to hit? Probably this. I mean, both of these, he probably wouldn't want to hit either of these. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so for what it's worth, he did cast a spell. So our storm count's one more. <laughs> But we didn't. Cast but we can't exile. cast. We can't cast this anyway. Oh, we man. could have exiled it in response. I guess, but that no. it's still gonna kill them. So no. there's really no point. No point. Yeah. Not yet. All right. 
Hmm. So he plays Kavu, kills one of these. He probably won't kill this one. Or he might, just because this one will hit us for more. I don't know. Kind of tough. Tough to say. Maybe he'll just, like, discard four cards and then play a Kavu. Be fine with that, too. Yeah. Pleasantries? No? No No pleasantries? pleasantries. Not a very pleasant man. This, This fella. This this chap. Oh man, we're gonna tendrils for like two. It's gonna be sweet. <laughs> I hope we draw the thing that makes them un- like paralyze. I think oh. it's called. Yeah, paralyze yeah. would be sweet. We only need like one spell on our spell uh-huh. count to actually win. So uh-huh. I know. Well, unless, unless he kills the he might yeah the two one that deals damage to us. Yeah, this is I'm this is really curious. I don't know which one he's going to pick. Uh he's gonna pick that one, so we get back a fiend. Cool. Excellent. Yeah, so we will do that. Mm-hmm. Get back fiend. That was probably right on his part, because this thing is slowly killing us. Yeah. Um So what is Fiend going to grab? Fiend is going to grab I'd, I would say the plus two, plus two, you can tell him to turn draw a card, because we are getting close to the point where he Yeah, can... that would just be like a kill, a murder. Yeah, yeah we'll take that. This guy's all, probably going to end up chump blocking. Anyway. Yeah. Depending. Well, we're not going to attack into a 4-2, no. so. Honestly, ex- exiling his dude in order to get him to discard a card might not have been the worst. Because then it's just like this is a crappy make him discard a card yeah. effect, you know. That's um, true. Okay, that's a that's a step. I think you just cycle that. Well, yeah, I wasn't gonna play it, but but where are we for? Okay, first first things first, I'm gonna attack for two. I yeah, think that's still right. Yeah, I'm still right. Because I don't think he can kill us with this because he only has three cards in hand, and we'll yeah. chump block the that. Even with the fourth, that's plus. And even with the three. pump too. Like, if he gets that back and then pumps. We have the exile still for yeah. that four damage. If Kla- mm-hmm. Kavu, if he's got a thing. So, I'm, I think I like cycling this now to see yeah. if we get, like, another land. Because if we get another land, then you just obviously play another land. So, I'm just going to cycle this now. Get another land. Play it. Play it. And, um... Say go. Yeah, I guess. I mean, it, it's, it is turn. very possible. If we could, survive this turn, yeah. we, we can conceivably kill him next. That's turn. true. That's true. Are we going to use exile on our own dude? We would attack with uh, what's his nuts? The one one, uh, and then exile it. No, but I, I'm going to chump block because he could just kill us. Oh right, yes. I have to chump block, and I think I'm going to chump block the four two, even though this could conceivably get way bigger. Yeah. 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 I still think that's right. All right. Declare blocks. Block you. Yeah, it's nice because he... We basically... I think at this point, we almost have to kill him this turn. I think so, yeah. Yeah. It seems like, but... uh, Yeah, so actually, can I go declare attackers and then in the combat damage step, exile this? Because it's still an attacker You'd at have that point. S- or at end combat? Because it's still an attacker? You'd have to stop... On it and see. I think I might do that. Depending on what he does here, of course. Yeah. I mean, he could just murder us. He could put murder all over us. Six mana. Six, is this six mana murder? Is he murdering? Is he going to do murders? Uh, No. He's going to just play some dude. <laughs> okay. Well, I think I'm okay with a cat beast. Um, we. It'd be nice to draw something here. That would be ideal. To draw something nice. Yes. Not a, a swamp, not so nice. A paralyze. Paralyze would be good. Okay, so we get in for two, right? Yeah. And then hopefully on the we end. cast these three things. So two puts him to six, and this will kill him. Yes. And he is tapped out. As long as we... So as long as... Exile works. Exile works the way I think it works, which I think it works that way. Should. Okay. I'm going to play this now. And I'm going to get in for two. 
Um, yeah, get in for two. And then no blocks. Okay. Takes two damage. Still an attacking creature. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Exile this. <laughs> like, this actually works the way yeah. I think it works, right? Yeah. Okay, well. We gain two life. Gain oh, two yeah. life. <laughs> oh, this oh, is yeah. silly. This is silly. <laughs> I can't believe this is Go to our main face. <laughs> Cast the dark ritual. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's just going to, like, stare. He's just yeah. Like, and we'll target him. And we'll pay one. <laughs> and then... <laughs> Tendrils of agony. Do I have to target him each time? Probably, right? Probably. Oh, my God. This is ridiculous. <laughs> he's, just, he's just staring at the screen. Yeah, probably. Oh. Did I just lose her tendrils for three? <laughs> uh, same targets. Yeah. Same targets. Yeah. And boom. Tendrils. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. Oh, and that just yeah, happened. And that just happened. <laughs> okay, so um I don't think there's anything to bring in. Like he didn't really have any artifacts or enchantments. We could put in a, a phantom nomad for What's a phantom nomad? Where are we seeing this? The those? first one in the white. Like it's literally the top card in the Oh, white that pile. dude. We could put I him know in that for the dude. flanking guy. Oh yeah, that's probably he... better than our other two drop guy, the yeah. one that we put in. The flanking guy. Um I can't believe that works. I'm still kind of, <laughs> I I'm having a hard time believing that that is a thing. That uh, tendrils for three just yeah. want to match. Uh huh. All right. Tendrils for three. <laughs> okay, so yeah, let's uh let's stick with that. that. Game two, after a thrilling awesomeness, awesome thing. <laughs> a thing I can't believe. A thing I happened. can't believe occurred. Um, him turn two. Yeah, I like this. I'm not going to mulligan, in fact. Opening beverages. And land go. That's what I like to see. Nothing occurring. Do we just him on turn two, or do we like wait till he plays some stuff and then just screw him over? Make him discard two Maybe awesome we wait things. Till he... Yeah. Depends on when he plays. Well, what's our other... Oh, we could we get in for the beats early, too. Yeah, well, let's, see. let's see what happens. Early. Oh, that dude. Not a fan of that dude. Um. Oh, this. Although this and this do well against him. The tapper and the yeah, infinite blocker. Um. Do we get our beats on, or do we? He's got five. Oh, you know what? I I think we get our beats on, and then maybe he'll discard a bunch of stuff to that, and then we can hit him for value. Even if yeah. he just discards like two things that he didn't want. You know. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, and I think it's good to get this guy out as early as uh, possible. In case he has, like, giant things with reach later or whatever. Mm -hmm. Also, he, it's one of those things that he's probably not going to want to burn a removal spell on early. Because it's going to also, like, help yeah, him. Yeah, it's going to slowly kill us. Yeah. Or we could uh, block and make him discard something. And then he'll probably play something. And then we him his other cards. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to take this. Yeah. Hopefully he discards three things and we look like awesomeness. He did not. Nah. I Too bad. would. Too bad. Oh, he yield. I am fine with taking a beat. Ooh, <laughs> we can bring ourselves back to life later. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get in for two, and I think I'm just gonna ham him at this point. Yeah. I don't think there's any point in waiting for value, and I don't want my mana tied up forever. Because then next turn we can drop two two drops. But so it seems like the ideal time. Yes, it is. And I do not need to stop here anymore. Uh, Yeah. Him targeting my lovely opponent. Yes. Say goodbye to two of your gentlemen. It's probably going to be like poop. Yeah. Well, maybe maybe he didn't have any other lands. That's possible, I guess. Yeah. Could have got both of his yeah. lands. And... Is that the case? Is that the case? Yeah, it's not the case. Oh, well, he didn't play another red. Maybe he has like a handful of double red stuff and we just like Yeah. Just got him. If we had one of the mind guys to see what's in his hand, that'd be good. It would be. Yeah. 
All right. Gets in for two beats. Two beats. He is two winning the race. Two beats. He is winning this race. Because ac- it's actually three beats. Although yeah. when we drop this and this, I think we're in a little better shape. I have a feeling that him probably wasn't great. Provoke. Can't be blocked by more than one creature. So one thing has to block it, and he can force me to block it. That's what provoke does, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Or it's if able? Or is it yeah. untap and... It was a, oh, it's untap and block if able. Well, that's yeah. annoying. That's really annoying. Because <laughs> I could just kill our tapper. Um, hmm. I'd just play the nomad then. Yeah, but... And oh, and, and, leave up, and leave up cycling. Yeah. That's a good idea. Well, I'm still getting him for two. That card's pretty good. You know, that guy he just played that for the true, one. yeah. And do I have to do this? Um, yeah, I have to do that. So no blocks, take some beats, and then we'll play this man. All right. So I, I we do have this to rebuild a little bit too, for what yeah. that's worth. But uh, we are losing this race. Remember to cycle. I will remember to cycle. Do you have a mark on his end step? Yeah. Uh, don't, yeah, I have, a, I have it on his end step. All right. I'm still, I'm still really happy with how that first game went. Just, that was just... <laughs> just like, that's yeah. not a thing that should ever have happened. <laughs> but it's somehow... Tendrils good. for value. Yeah. Well, it's for victory. Just it wasn't <laughs> Tendrils like... for victory. Tendrils for victory. Just not in the way that it should have been. No. <laughs> I think he's thinking, think. doing the maths, deciding if he wants to provoke. It's like, hmm, hmm. These tendrils kill me. Yeah, and he's come to a decision. Uh, is it going to happen? Is it going to happen? Um, I don't know if he actually wants to. Well, he probably does, because we've, we've shown him. Fly. We've shown him tendrils. Yeah. He probably doesn't want his life total too low. So he'll probably want to force the trade here. Just because this is flying and this is kind of outclassed. Mm-hmm. It's not... Oh, really? Okay. That's not what I would have assumed would happen. But I guess I guess it's tantamount to just a chump block. So... um, Yes. Guess I don't have a choice. Just seeing how that worked. I was expecting it to auto-block. Never played with Provoke on Magic Online. It's interesting. Okay. Whoa! It did damage and then it removed it. Sweet. Oh, nice. I didn't. Re- uh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Yeah. But cycle. cycle. No, not yet. It's not a Zen step. Oh. Yeah. Come on. I have to wait till this goes down one. <laughs> oh man, that was sweet. I didn't know it worked that way. This guy's way better than I thought he was. Um, two damage to target creature. Oh, so he's gonna. Oh. Is he going to kill it, or is he going to kill the flyer? I, he might kill this one. I, I think he'd kill know. the flyer now. He'd probably kill a flyer. Because this is just a 1-1 one, one now for two. It's not that great. I'm glad that Provoke guy's dead, because now this... Really? He just well, doesn't want that. I guess. I guess it blanks Mongrel, but Mongrel's not great. He has one card in hand. All right. Let's uh, cycle this. Gain two life. Oh, yeah. Alleviate some pain from this fledgling djinn. Yes, I would like to use it. <laughs> what kind of question is that? Why would you cycle it and choose to not gain life? I don't know. Ooh, hey. That's four damage. That's that's four damage. All right. Four creatures. So starting with you. Um, oh, hey, look. Is that we how can that works? see what the last card Oh, we can is. too. And we can cast this. And we can cast that. Or this. Uh, let's Let's open with this, dude. Just to know what we're working with. Yeah. I mean, at best, he discards it to Mongrel. Yeah. Or it's nothing. Like, it's a land. Uh, Salt Blast. That's a good one, actually. And then... Get in for two. I think we have to press the advantage because we have stuff like this. And then I think we play the Tapper to just say, hey. You think the Tapper over the choice? Yeah. We don't want choice yet. Okay. Tapper's going to look at him and go, oh, shit. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. yeah. Got to be careful. All right. I don't mind how this is going at the moment. It's really slow. Like, I kind of figured this would be really, 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 really slow. 
What we want is a dark ritual for our death grasp. Oh, yeah, we would. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we want to kill them. Yeah. Tyrant's choice, then death grasp. Mm-hmm. So that would really? be sweet. Uh, do we block any of this? I don't think so. Nah. I think taking four is accept an acceptable loss. This is just a one-two, right? Yeah. Yeah. Still got a card in hand. Still has a card in hand. What could it be? I don't know. But if it's a land, he probably should play it because he knows I have these. Like, rather than leave it up to pump Mongrel. Yeah. Because he, he, like, he's seen this. He's seen um, him. Although, I think it cast him already, so. Oh, it's the cycling guy. Okay. Well, it was land, but. Yep. He's yeah, that's that's probably right. Okay, oh. and there's another land. All right. Yeah, I think that was, I think that was still right on his part. So, do I just, um at this point, get in for four? Put him to ten? And then, like, Tyrant's Choice? Also, this is, we're doing the damage version, right? Probably. Do we... Vote for torture? <laughs> yeah, if we get in, put them to 10, and then... Hmm. And then do we play that Swamp and Death Grasp for 4 him? Well, no, I, I like the, I like doing this before this because... Oh, well, I guess we can always get the 4. That's yeah, true. Yeah, we can always get the yeah. 4. Um, I kind of like leaving up Tapper just to tap... That's true. Mongrel. Like, it's only one extra damage, but I am going to get in with these for three here. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's best to just yeah. tap Mongrel. It's not a threat. No. Or we could always Tyrant's Choice and vote for him sacking a creature, and then... Um, we could. And then we tap the one that survives. That's not a terrible idea. Yeah. Let's do... Let's play this before playing a land, so it looks like we don't have one. Yeah. Okay, so I need to vote for oh, no. Death. Instead of torture, correct? Um, yeah, I think that's how that's how it works. Yeah, we will vote for death. Okay, this is a weird card. <laughs> well, it's a conspiracy card. Yeah, yeah. They just wanted. Okay, to uh, I'm gonna vote for death, and he's gonna vote for torture. All right, we tortured him, and then uh, play land, and we'll say go. So definitely tap this one because it has yeah. the well, really has one card in hand, but still. It's still, one it's still better than a 2-2. Yeah. So stop on combat. I did. Oh. You're ahead of me. I'm yes. Not, I'm not paying I, always, I always stop on combat. Oh. It's it's my default behavior. And I think we got the him. The only time if, I play it, magic online is true. here. So. That's true. Um, I think unless he drew something great, I think we actually have him dead. Because yeah. we do this for f four... And then we have all those to get in. So even if he has one blocker, we're good. Yeah. Of course, he could just have shenanigans. He could, like, wipe our team or something crazy. Or he could have nothing. All right. Um, I think we just go for it. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, we're dead on the backswing, potentially, if he's got, like... I don't no, think this because fog we're gaining life. The set. Oh, yeah, we are gaining life. I forgot about the life. Right. Okay. Beats. 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 Ba beats. He stopped on our combat, so he might have something. Um, okay. He did stop on our combat, which is fishy. But we will get in for beats. Okay. Is he taking the beats? Looks like he's taking the beats. And then Death, Death grasp, grasp for him victory. for full value. Boom. Chakalaka. I don't think he can counter it either. So. No, <laughs> red green. Yeah, yeah. I, I oh, he could gain. It. He could gain himself life. No, no. All right, that was round one. Can't sneaked it by. It sneaked it by. We'll see you for round two.